The Young Man and His Cat A certain young man used to play with a beautiful cat, of which he grew so fond that at last he fell in love with it, to such a degree he couldn't rest neither night nor day for the excess of his passion. In this condition he prayed to Venus, the goddess of beauty, to pity and relieve his pain. The good-natured goddess was propitious and heard his prayers, and the cat, which he held in his arms, was instantly transformed into a beautiful young woman. The youth was transported with joy and married her that very day. At night, while they were in bed, the bride unfortunately heard a mouse behind the <laughs> hangings and sprang from the arms of her lover to pursue it. The youth was ashamed and Venus offended to see her sacred rites thus profaned by such unbecoming behaviour and perceiving that her new convert, though a woman in outward appearance, was a cat in her heart. She caused her to return to her old form again and her manners and person might be suitable to each other. Application. This fable, however extravagant and unnatural in its composition, is intended to depict and check the blind instinctive ardour of the passion of love, that, that transports of which cover all imperfections so that its devotees consider neither quality nor merit. It is like an idol of our own creating, which we fashion into whatever figure or shape we please and then run mad for it. The fable also shows that no charm can raise from dirt a grovelling mind, and that people of a low turn of spirit and mean education cannot change their principles by changing their situation, for in the midst of splendour and magnificence they still retain the same narrow sentiments and seldom fail to betray by some dirty action their original base baseness which no embroidery can conceal. And though fortune has been pleased to lift them out of the mire, we still see the silly, awkward blockheads displaying their lack of mind and education through all their ensigns of dignity. If anything more need be added, it can only be with a view of more plainly putting inexperienced youth on their guard against making inconsiderate connections, lest they take a cat into their bosom instead of an amiable consort and companion for life.